about a mile and a half from my destination, Manoa Falls. And I just thought I'd show you just how awesome this place looks here. It's a little, it's a lot, it's a lot different from Kona. That I will tell you. But it's a very nice place. Look at that. Thing is huge. So this time I'm going up the hike. And as you can tell, this place really looks like a jungle. Um, we're gonna go to the, see the falls. But I learned my lesson from last time. Um, that's why my face looks so greasy. Uh, this time I covered myself from head to toe in this stuff. So, actually, of the insect repellents, I got it because it is the one that is, um, how can I say it? It's not perfectly comfortable, but it's the one that's going to get on your nerves the least. It doesn't feel as, as horrible as the other ones. The other ones really feel like you've got all kinds of grease. This one, too. You just can't stop that, but it doesn't feel as horrible. But if I want to handle the camera, got to have a clean tissue. So I got about five or six. But, you know, lesson learned. Let's go. Check that out. More running water. And you, looking behind the camera, probably can't even see all the detail I can. Like I said, I really wish I had a nicer camera. Here's where it all comes from. Look at that. Look at this. Oh my God, that is, look, that is just so amazing. Good God. Imagine if you had one of these where you live. Look at that. Ah. Oh my God, that is just, wow. And let's zoom in a little over here. Look at that. And then let's just go have a look at what, where the water ends or where it trails off. To. So as it comes down from here, goes off this way. Heads off over here. Look at this. All the way down the hill. Down the hill, down the hill. Wow. Tell me this isn't just like the most amazing thing to have that thing right there and the river that it forms this if i had all the money in the world this is for what i would uh, what it would look like wow and i couldn't do as good a job as nature did 
But guess what? As an extra bonus, check this out. There's another one. It's not as obvious, but it's there. If you look, you'll see. Let me zoom in a little. See? Isn't that, isn't that just amazing? Wow. So besides the lower path, we have this other upper path. I'm not sure where it goes, but I guess now is as good a time as any to figure it out. slippery. At this point, you're going to probably need a walking stick or just be extremely, extremely careful. But even then you might slip. Yeah, look at that. Ugh. So I can't even see a path. So I think this is going to be the end of my travels up here because I honestly cannot see where the path continues. I'm going to keep going until I can, but every time I go move up further, it's looking more and more like uh, I'm about to hit a dead end. So I feel pretty bad, but I think this is the end for me because if you look, this is like a steep climb. There's water dropping, and it's raining, and it's dark. I mean, I'm very daring. I've probably gone where more than 95% of people wouldn't. But to go any higher without having some sort of equipment, that's just, I'm asking to break my legs again. I know I'm reckless, but up to a point, even that. So, sorry guys, maybe next time. Feels bad that I can't go all the way up there, but at least I went this far. So I'm on my way back and it's dark. And I feel like I've just got like 10,000 bugs all over me. Oh, this was crazy, but you know, I was the one who stupidly did it. So <laughs> on me, I know, but it was kind of exciting anyway. I mean, you know, no risk, um, at least for me, you know, I may never come back here. If I do, I'm going to make sure and go to the top of that one. Oh, but uh, like I said, this is slippery. I put on a second coat of that bug repellent. Not very pleasant, but as I said, it's better than the others. At least it's not like really bad, you know, but this is hard, very hard. Um, but you know what? There's something rewarding about doing very difficult things. And as long as you don't like risk your life, I think it's worth it to do something risky like that once in a while. I don't know, what do you think? So I still have about another 10 minutes to go and it is so dark now down here that it's even dangerous to come down this way, even though before it was actually the easy part. So, I know, laugh at me, ha ha ha, that's what I get. <laughs> well, so I'm finally out <laughs> after about two hours. Feels good, man. Feels good.